right, so today I'm going to talk about static electricity. Now, static electricity is the answer to the question that why when I take this balloon and rub it against this dog, it sticks. Static electricity occurs when two objects, one with a lower than average number of electrons, this has a net positive charge, and the other with a higher than average number of electrons, this has a net negative charge. Now, since positives and negatives attract, these two objects will stick together, just as magnets do. However, over time, the one with the higher number of le electrons, electrons will transfer over from there to the number with lower than average electrons. So, over time, the electrons will bounce out, and when these reach equilibrium, the two objects will, um, you know, break apart and just fall off. There is also the question of why if I don't rub the balloon against the dog, it just falls off. Now, the natural state of all objects is to have an equilibrium, that is, a equal positive and negative charge, uh, so the net charge will be zero. Um, and since the net charge is zero for both of these, they won't attract. It only works when there's a positive charge in one and a negative charge in the other. Now, you can create this positive charge by rubbing these two objects together, um, which will cause electrons to f transfer from one area to the other, giving this a negative charge and this a positive charge, so then the objects will stick together. Oh, and I feel I should mention that the Project for Awesome is next Monday, um, and given that Monday is only like two days after Saturday, I may not post a video next Saturday and just post it on Monday for Project for Awesome. Now, I may still post two separate videos, I haven't quite decided yet, but I'm just letting you know that my normal Saturday video may be postponed to Monday. But yeah, hope you enjoyed it, hope you learned something, and see ya!